What's up guys? It's me, Bob Reese from the Bronx, and I just want to tell you something, guys. Listen, so when I was in the train and you seen that young man bugging out like that, this young lady was next to me, and I don't know if anybody's seen the footage. Um, evidently she was recording herself. And she was chuckling and heckling this poor guy. And I said to her, oh, who's going viral first? So that was pure sarcasm. And I thought that posting that in that manner, putting it on my thumbnail or whatever the hell it's called, people would understand that that was sarcasm. Come on, guys, you should know me better than that. I would never, ever, ever make a joke about somebody bugging out like that on the train. If you heard the way I said it, it was in sarcasm. And then I was telling them not to laugh. So please, whoever thinks that I would ever, ever make a joke about that, please don't ever think that about me. I could never be like that, guys. I would be the most shallowest thing in the world. So please, for the love of God, I apologize about the way I, um, about the way I wrote that on my thumbnail. That I, when I read it at first, I was like, you know, maybe they'll catch on to the sarcasm, but you know, evidently nobody did. So, oops, my bad. Next time I'll be more discretion on how I, you know, write things down. Remember, I'm still new to all this, but it's no excuse. That was very shallow, and I do apologize, but I didn't mean it in that perspective. So that being said, I hope everyone has a blessed day, and um, there's more videos to come. All right, guys? God bless you. Chat. Oh, and one more thing. If anybody doubts that I'm clean, look at all those bottles. Bottles up the old wazoo. Okay? So guys, please, for the love of God, don't think of me like that, man. Don't ever think of Barbarisi could be so shallow to th to make a, uh, a joke out of somebody. Now, the reason I did, if I didn't have my baby, I would have approached him. I definitely would have. But what happened was, if you listen, my big glass bottle bends on the side. And what happened was, is that, oh, nice. <laughs> Look at this, guys. What happened was, is that when my bottle made a noise on the side, he got up in a fit of rage, like, oh, it's got a move in that noise. So I had to move. I had to, at that point, I had to move. So please. Nobody think that about me. I can never be that shallow. Um, and everyone have a blessed day, okay? My friend Desire is calling me. Desire, if you're watching this, I'm about to pick up the phone right now, girl. All right, ciao.